This page lists the known kings of Lydia, both legendary and historical. Lydia was an ancient kingdom in western Anatolia during the 1st millennium BC. It may have originated as a country in the 2nd millennium BC and was possibly called Myonia at one time, given that Herodotus says the people were called Myonians before they became known as Lydians. Herodotus and other sources refer to three dynasties, the Myoniae, Heraclidae Heraclids, and Myrmnidae. The first two are legendary, though later members of the Heraclid dynasty are at least semi-legendary. The Myrmnidae are historical. Myoniae The earliest Myonian or Lydian king mentioned by Herodotus is Mainz who was the father of Atys. There was a severe famine during the reign of Atys and half of the citizens, led by Atys' son Tyrrhenus, emigrated to Italy as the Tyrrhenians. Other sources, such as Strabo, named T. Molus and his son Tantalus as kings of the region about the same time, supposedly ruling from the land about Mount Sipolis, but it is asserted that these two were the same people as Mainz and Atys, especially as Omphale is a member of both families. The known legendary kings are Mainz Atys, son of Mainz Lydus, son of Atys Iardanisherodotus says that Lydus gave his name to the country and its people. The line of Lydus continued through an unstated number of generations until they, as Herodotus says, "...turned over the management of affairs to the Heraclids." He adds that the Heraclids in Lydia were the descendants of Heracles and a slave girl belonging to Iardanus. The line was from Heracles through Alcius, Belus and Ninus to Agron who was the first Heraclid king of Lydia. <laughs> Heraclidae Herodotus says the Heraclids ruled Lydia for 505 years through 22 generations with son succeeding father all down the line from Agron to Candoels. While Candoels was the last of the Heraclids to reign at Sardis, Herodotus says Agron was the first and thereby implies that Sardis was already the capital of Lydia in Myonian times. Candoels died c.687 BC and so the 505-year span stated by Herodotus suggests c.1192 BC for Agron's accession. The known Heraclid kings are Agron, Florida, c.1192 BC, legendary great-great-grandson of Heracles and a Lydian slave girl via Alcius, Belus and Ninus. 19 legendary kings, names unknown, all succeeding father to son Meles, aka Mersus, 8th century BC, semi-legendary father of Candoels. Candoels, aka Merciless, died c.687 BC, probably historical, son of Meles, murdered by Yegus. Topic. Myrmnidae Although this dynasty is historical, the dates for it have never been determined with certainty. The traditional dates are derived from Herodotus, who gives some rain lengths, but these have been questioned by modern scholars on the basis of synchronisms with Assyrian history. The name of the dynasty GK. Myrmnades may be attested in Lydian transmission as M lambda imna. Etymologically, it possibly contains the Carion word mno son or descendant, which would then represent an argument for the Carion origin of the Myrmnad clan. There were five kings, all historical figures, in the Myrmnad line. Yegus, aka Gujas, c. 687 c. BC, husband of Candles's widow. Artes, aka Artaus, c. 652 c. BC, son of Yegus. Sadiates, c. 603 c.591 BC, son of Artes. Aliates, c.591 to 560 BC, son of Sadiates. Croesus, aka Croesos, 560 to 546 BC, son of Aliates. Yegus died in battle c.652, fighting against the Cimmerians, and was succeeded by Artes. The most successful king was Aliates, under whom Lydia reached its peak of power and prosperity. Croesus was defeated by Cyrus the Great at the battles of Teria and Thymbra. Cyrus annexed Lydia after the siege of Sardis which ended in early 546 BC, but the fate of Croesus himself is uncertain. References Sources <references> <references>
Barry, J. B., Meigs, Russell 1975 first published 1900. A History of Greece 4th edition. London, Macmillan Press. ISBN 0-333-15492-4. Herodotus first published 1954. Byrne, A. R., de Salincourt, Aubrey, E. D. S. The Histories. London, Penguin Books. ISBN 0-14-051260-8.